As if it wasn't enough coming to holiday in Hawaii, I found somewhere where you can experience true Polynesian culture all in one place. I mean, maybe check out Tahiti or Fiji or Samoa, except in Hawaii. I mean, <laughs> this place has it all. Located on Oahu's North Shore, the Polynesian Cultural Center is one of the island's top attractions. The whole idea and the purpose of the Polynesian Cultural Center is to preserve and portray the culture and the arts and crafts of Polynesia. Altogether, there's six Polynesian villages representing the unique island cultures of Hawaii, Fiji, New Zealand, Samoa, Tahiti and Tonga. Now, as a tourist, what can we expect? You have cultural shows, hands-on activities, and you also have the food, where you get to experience the culture through the food. Yes! A man-made river runs through the entire property. This is a 42-acre land, so you do not want to miss out on those canoe rides. No, definitely not. It'll take you from one point of the center to the very end, and you'll get to see an overview of all the different islands that is out here today. But I can't go past a double dose of Hawaii. So the second verse talks about the mom and how she likes to make lays. So we're going to shape our mom. And one, two, three, and four to the mountains. Pick the flowers. Slow, put in your basket. Hands up. And one, two, switch. One and two. All right, so yeah. I think we got this. So we're going to rotate our hips two times slow, three times fast. One. Yep. Two fast. And one, two, three. One more time. One. Two, and one, two, three, hands up. With some hula under my belt, I'm off to New Zealand to learn more about the legend of the haka. <laughs> and brush up on my warrior skills. Now this game was made for young children to help them develop the necessary skills to eventually become a warrior. It teaches hand-eye coordination, but also teamwork. Okay. So we're going to go one, two, one, two, three, Ooh. one, two, and toss. And you, I just ruined your trust for me. <laughs> oh, no! Toss, right, toss, one, right, toss. Oh. One, two, I am toss, horrible. Down together, toss, lift, and... Oh. I think you would make a great warrior. I think I would be better, um, I think, just clearing the space for the real warriors. That's really what I... Nearby, Tonga is definitely as lively as I expected it to be. This tourist attraction is not for the wallflowers. A non-stop interactive experience. over towards the island of Samoa, Samoa, which is at the heart of Polynesia. And what can I expect to learn there? There's the fire-making activity yes. that you might enjoy. Yes! Hmm. Mm hmm Yes. Okay. Same spot. Oh, wow, okay, this is a lot harder than what I thought it would be. Oh, I'm seeing a bit of smoke. Yeah, that's good, man. Faster, faster. Don't stop. Oh, man, I need a half time. <laughs> oh, bro. Your arms get tired so quick. <laughs> <laughs> if we get stuck on a deserted island, can I come live with you? Come get me. <laughs> <laughs> and before we call it a day, I've always dreamt of going to Tahiti. In case your cultural cravings haven't been completely satisfied after a day among the Polynesian villages, you can stay on for a nightly luau. The only time I've ever heard of a luau is in movies and TV shows growing up, so this is epic. Can you tell me what's the history behind the luau? What is it? Luau basically is the traditional Hawaiian festival or party. Right. There's a festival of food and entertainment going all throughout the night, and also you'll be expecting a whole pig being brought out of the pit. So you've never seen that before, look forward to it. Can you bring a pig out? Yes. Okay. 
bucket list. Bucket list check. check. <laughs>